California's most famous corgi is critically ill tonight. He's just a, a neat dog, and we're all very sad that he's suffering right now. Governor Brown's dog, Sutter, remains in an animal hospital after undergoing emergency surgery on Friday. CBS 13's Adrian Moore is in the newsroom now. She has details on Sutter's prognosis. Adrian? Sam and Christina, a spokesperson for the governor, tells us things are not looking as promising as they had hoped. We've been told the first lady was able to take Sutter on a short walk earlier today, and he headed straight for the car, clearly wanting to go home. He's brought cool to the Capitol, has been an advocate for education, and has even promoted fitness by sharing his downward facing dog to thousands of Twitter followers. But now, California's therapy dog in chief needs a boost in health and spirits himself. While in surgery, the doctors discovered numerous masses, most likely cancer, um, in his intestines, his lymph nodes, and his liver. Veterinarians weren't able to remove all of those masses and are waiting for results of a biopsy to determine if, in fact, they are cancerous. As you can imagine, this is a very hard time for the governor and the first lady. Hard because Sutter has become a fixture around the Capitol, so much so that some have argued the 13 year old Corgi is responsible for softening the governor's image. He's there in our office on a regular basis, lifting our spirits, um, coming through our trash cans, helping us with food cleanup. Sutter's mom and our first lady posted photos of Sutter in stitches with the message Keep fighting, Sutter. We want you home. Hashtag Sutter come home. The second shows Sutter with sister Calusa in the message, Calusa misses you. Calusa was here in the office this afternoon and was just not her normal peppy, you know, vivacious self. She seems a little down, so I think she senses that, that something's wrong. With hundreds of messages rolling in on social media and email, the hope is that our furry statesman gets well soon. We're all pulling for him. Um, he's a fighter. We're hoping he'll pull through this. And he sure is cute. It's still unclear when Sutter will be able to come home. And if you'd like to send Sutter some well wishes yourself, you can go to the CBS 13 Facebook page and leave a message. Guys. Oh, well, Sutter, we're pulling for you, bud. Yeah, absolutely. Get well soon. Adrian, thank you.